I'm here because it's absolutely essential that um, we get back to a point in this country that people matter in politics, not money. That money doesn't have any inalienable rights, that it gives nobody more power and more say in our world than any other person in this country. How did I find out? Um, uh, Twitter. I found out uh, maybe about a week ago on Twitter, and I showed up and checked it out, and just trying to do what I can do, can to help. What would you see as a success coming out of today? Um, you know, the interesting thing about this is it seems very different than other uh, protest activities and campaigns that I see. Um, I. I it's not going to be easy for people to understand that the success is not going to be winning one thing. That success is actually people having this conversation and, and really starting to grapple with things that people have been taking for granted for so long. And so I don't see how it could fail. And that doesn't mean that uh, this is the moment that's going to transform America. I hope it is. But um, uh, I think that this is... A, lo a conversation has been totally missing from from our world for too long. And if it did transform America, what, what form would you want it to take? Oh, uh, and that's then, no, that's just. But it would just be my opinion, and that becomes the interesting part about this is my opinion having to filter through all of these folks what real democracy was supposed to be. I mean, nobody has to pay an entry fee to come and participate in this conversation. And what I think it should be now, I'm, I'm going to find so many people who have great ideas, and I'm sure by the end of this, uh, my view is going to be very changed. So for you, does, does this day um, go on into tomorrow and the next day? For me personally? Yeah. Uh, I won't be staying every night. I'll be staying tonight. Um, I'll be coming back every couple days to help out, replenish, resupply, whatever logistics need done. Um, you know, but it, I'm not at this point in my life where I can be here every day. I'd like to see my kid. He's still got to go to school. But, you know, whatever I can do to make this thing last as long as it needs to to figure out the really difficult problems in this world. What do you, what do you think of this as a leaderless movement? Uh, oh, personally, um, I think what people mean when they try to say that, and of course, I'm sure they'll disagree. I think people are upset about unearned titles suddenly giving people legitimacy. Um, but I think that leaders, in the purest sense of the word, meaning people who have people who have a following, people who have a vision that people believe in and 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 are willing to help build based on credibility and trust. I, I don't have a problem with that. But I think we're fighting because so many people who are leaders, you know, so to speak, never earn their position or earn their position through bribery, meaning they bought their way. And that's not earned. That's not earned. Um, your, your, your credibility is earned by gaining the confidence and trust of the people you work with and treating them with respect and giving them a vision. And maybe they share the vision or maybe that you're not the leader, but you're the best articulate person to say this, but you've all come up with this vision. So. Hopefully we can separate those two ideas of leadership and not get rid of the fact that some people do excel at certain things. Some people are excellent electricians. That brother who made the Vogue poster over there, I'd never be able to do anything like that in a million years. You know, that's, that's just his ability. And we shouldn't knock ability. We've just lost any meritocracy in this United States. There is no merit to the folks who have leadership titles in this country. Are you here with your woman or uh, representing your woman or independent? Uh, right now, this is just my personal view. Um, we are a member of a labor council who has definitely come out in support. My membership doesn't meet until Wednesday, so I'm going to bring this to them. Um, however they see fit in a democracy to participate in this, I'm at their, I'm at their obviously, their decision. So I'm not going to speak for them, but I'm, I'm here and uh, I don't plan on 
walking away. Is there anything else you'd like to say? No.